I'm sort of losing my mind right now because Super Smash Brothers has apparently been rumored for Nintendo Switch by a well-renowned video game leaker, Emily Rogers. Apparently the game is in development and also apparently it's coming out this year. But what we don't know is, is this some type of port of the Wii U version or is this a new version from the ground up? I can't imagine they developed a game completely from the ground up in such a short time since the game released on Wii U. And honestly, I love that game. I think mechanically it's the best of all the Smash Bros. I know the Melee lovers are gonna hate when I say that, but it's my favorite one of them all. I think it has the best roster. And if they can somehow get all the characters from the Wii U version, including the third party characters like Cloud and Bayonetta, onto the Switch version with no hassle, I think we're looking at the definitive Smash Brothers title on Switch. One thing I've always said about Super Smash Brothers is that I believe it should be a platform title rather than just a game that releases and maybe or maybe it doesn't get some DLC after it launches. I think Super Smash Brothers has the ability to be a huge platform game like Rocket League, Overwatch, League of Legends. We've already seen Nintendo support games a long time after they launch. I would love to see that trend continue with Super Smash Brothers. So where does this leak or rumor come from? It comes from Emily Rogers. She's mostly known for leaking out a bunch of information on the Switch before it was announced officially by Nintendo. However, she has had some misses in terms of her predictions and whatnot. She once said that Soul Calibur V was coming to Wii U. Obviously, that never happened. Maybe at one point that was in talks between Nintendo and Namco. We, we won't really know for sure. Obviously, the game never came to the Wii U. All I know is that people are dying for Super Smash Bros. on Switch, and I have said before, if Nintendo can't get out Pokemon or Metroid anytime this year, I think Smash Bros. has the potential to fill in the gap of that first party impact that we had with the first year of the Switch, which is pretty much unbeatable. Zelda Mario and a bunch of other first party games, ARMS, like Xenoblade Chronicles 2, all in one year is kind of crazy. But Smash Brothers is a big juggernaut. I can imagine them releasing it this year just to keep the Switch in everyone's mindset. And my god, if they can get all the previous characters from the Wii U version, that would be amazing and even add some more. Me and my buddy Andrew, you know him from this channel. We plan on doing a Super Smash Brothers video predicting the characters that we want to see in the game. But I'm also curious what characters you want to see. Do you think that we're going to get some more characters from Bayonetta, more third party stuff, Crash Bandicoot? There was a recent rumor of that coming to Switch. Obviously, it's anything's possible, but the one character I think deserves to be in the next Smash Brothers is where is my Banjo-Kazooie? Come on, Microsoft, make it happen. Actually, Microsoft has said they're open to putting Banjo in Smash Brothers, so that would be really awesome. Make it happen, Nintendo. The last thing I want to talk about before I go is what are we going to do when Smash Brothers comes to Switch and we can't use that GameCube controller? I know a lot of people love that. It's perfect for Smash Brothers. I personally liked the Wii U uh, Pro Controller with Smash Brothers, so I'm sure I would be completely fine with the Switch Pro Controller. I think it'd be great, but Smash Brothers without the GameCube controller is just kind of crazy to think about. Um, it'd be awesome to get some type of uh, Joy-Con attachments that's the exact shape of the GameCube con uh, controllers. I know we've seen a lot of mock-ups from fans on the internet, and they actually look pretty cool. So I would love to see Nintendo go down that route, or just maybe let us use our Smash Brothers controllers for the Wii U, plug them into the USB. They actually already work for some games, which is kind of funny. But I'm curious everything what you think. As always, leave all your thoughts in the comments below. Let me know what characters you want to see in Smash Brothers. Do you think we'll see some crazy third-party characters? Well, I mean, we've already gotten Cloud. That's pretty crazy enough. I'm Brett Medlock, and I will talk to you guys later.